When I look at this building, I said this building, downtown Marsh Harbor, the pinnace is built as futuristic. Uh, the actual building is, it's about uh, three to four feet higher than it used to be. I went and asked when they're gonna have the party. Um, I think I'm on holy ground so I could come here and film the good workmanship. Boy, the construction people have been going a while. I wonder when they're opening. They got the hurricane shutters ready, just in case. Um, one thing that you don't see in Marsh Harbor is the joy to see that they have so much parking here. They have um, prepared many parking space. That is uh, not normal in Abaco. You gotta figure out how to park. You just build a building and the customers gotta figure out how to get to the building. But this one's well planned, futuristic. On what, on what we ought to do. All manicure, something you don't see in the front of buildings, plants, beautiful plants, structure. I don't know what to call this building because they ain't got no name, I guess. It's the green building. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful structure. It's this this building just gives you hope as a Bohemian, as an Abaconian, to see the planning. That's the word we don't we use. We usually just get something in our mind and we go with it. We don't put it on paper. But in this one, this is well planned out. Uh, right here by the traffic light, downtown Marshall. And I just say, boy, I'm impressed. I'm proud to see that Abaconians could build a building like this out of pocket. Uh, and right a couple blocks from here, the government of the Bahamas, the government of the Bahamas have been built a, a toilet on a building that made 160, 180 million dollars a year. Uh, they even got the golden coconut, coconut in the back of there. But beautiful, beautiful, beautiful building. I can do a video like this all day. I can say nothing about the building across the road. The only building that they ain't touched yet. But I can leave that for another video. But this is downtown Marsh Harbor. Today is the 21st of September 2023. As I go in the backyard, everything is all fenced in. It's amazing how these buildings are constructed. And one thing we learned to do is to fence people out after the hurricane. But this is a beautiful building. Um, one of the beautiful, most beautiful buildings that was built in Abaco since Hurricane Doreen. It's Kai Care, right downtown Marsh Harbor. Looking at the traffic light, Kai Care.